Several months now, migrants have been applying for asylum using the CBP-1 app. Yeah, our Adolfo Muniz uh, took a closer look at the process and shows us how it's really working for those across the border. It seems like despite of all the complaints by migrants here in Reynosa, Mexico, CBP-1 is actually working in little by little every day. It's 12.30 p.m. at the Reynosa Hidalgo International Bridge. Jerome just got there. He is now the last of a line of migrants who finally got a CBP-1 appointment. He's a little anxious, but it's just now a short wait after everything he's been through. And that is something all migrants can agree to. Just like Jean, who's barely arriving at the International Bridge, who thinks that maybe for some people it is actually harder. And finally, everybody holds their breath. The line begins moving as CBP agents start checking people in. One at a time, slowly but surely, there are now less migrants in Reynosa and more in the United States of America. And in Matamoros, in December, before the introduction of CBP-1, there were thousands of migrants sleeping in the streets. Today, that same street looks empty. And this, despite of the initial multiple complaints. Complaints from close to the 15,000 mainly Haitian migrants at the time who felt they wouldn't be able to get in. But the numbers show something else. In January and February, about 8,000 in Reynosa and 11,000 in Matamoros were accepted. Today, there are only two daily appointments and the lines are visibly shorter. The Senda, the Vida, one and two shelters are still full, but the director and the staff are convinced of what they say. Están saliendo, simplemente no, no están saliendo como lo hacían tiempos anteriores, pero está funcionando, o sea, no podemos decir que eh, ahorita lo que sí se está es mejorando. But at least for Jerome, patience paid up. He will now rejoin his family and leave all of these complexities behind. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. For more refreshing stories about your community, click the subscribe button over here. You can also download our Spectrum News app and tune in to Channel 55 on Dish and DirecTV to get live news coverage, weather updates every 10 minutes, and more. We'll see you then.